Hey you guys, welcome back to another video. It's been a little bit, low minute, but we're back. So today I'm going to be doing a haul from Target. I'm sure you all know Target came out with a couple collab collections. One with, you know, I should know the people's names. It, I think it was three. Three collabs. I bought from two of the three um, collabs. I got stuff from Lisa Marie Fernandez and Kushni. And Kushni was the one black designer out of three designers. The other ones, I don't know what they were, but they weren't black. But I got two pieces. Two pieces from Kushni's line. And then I got two pieces from Lisa Marie Fernandez line. I'm going to start off with this one because this one's my favorite. So, yeah. This is the dress. I want to start off by saying... Shoot. I want to start off by saying it has pockets. If I can get my hands to the other one. It has pockets. So, that's cute. And it's super flowy. Look at that. I love this dress. It has this cute little bow. You don't have to have the bow here if you don't want to. But, you know, you can tuck it in. Tuck it into the dress. But I like the bow just for that little added bit of cuteness. I don't have nothing like this. I don't think I've seen a dress like this in a while if I've ever seen one. But I really love the flowiness of this. Like, it's so flowy. It gives me that, I don't really like to bring up her name, but it brings me that Marilyn Monroe feel. When she's over that vent on the ground in New York City and she's like, ah. yeah, it gives me that effect. Because when you when you going down the steps or if there's some wind underneath you, it does do that balloon effect. And I think it's so cute. I love this dress. You can dress her up with some heels. God, I keep looking for these pockets. You can dress her up with some heels. You can dress her down with some flats. You can untie this and just have it hanging if you want to you can have it tied up and be all cutesy and extra girly but i love this one this one is my favorite and that's why i'm starting off with it i love this dress so let's go ahead to the next one okay so this is the next piece this one is also by lisa marie fernandez i love this dress as well it comes with a sash to tie it around your waist. You could tie it around your waist. I don't know. I don't know. Is that? Is that cute? You could tie it around your waist. Or you could tie it right up underneath your boobs. I think I, you know, I didn't even try it like this, but... I'm looking in my mirror on my dresser. I didn't even try it like this, but I think I like it like this best. But, um, yeah, you can tie it around your waist. Oh, wire. You can tie it right up hers. Up underneath your boobies. And you might have to play with the fabric gathers but yeah it's nice off the shoulder what does it look like on the shoulders kind of house on the prairie this is sexy in the city house on the prairie okay we're going with sexy I like it I like this one too now this one what I found out with everything that I tried I'm gonna put it back on my waist what I found with everything that I tried was the sizing was inconsistent and I'm not going to blame it on the material. I'm not going to blame it on 
I'm not going to blame it on anything. Well, I am going to blame it on something, but, you know, not the typical stuff. What I want to say is the design. So, how things are designed is where the sizing gets tricky. So, with this, I got a large. Thinking that that's what I would need. Uh, and that's the point. No, is this a medium or a large? Oh, girl. I need to put my glasses on so I can, so I can see this. Yeah, this is a large. So, I got this in a large thinking that the waist part of it, I was going to need a large to give me some extra space. That's not the case. Not the case at all. I could have went with a medium. I hope they have a medium. I would go back and exchange that for this one. Because when you put this on, this is like a straight up box. Straight up in the down box. So, no. I did not need a large because I have I have a lot of extra I got a lot of extra material when I put this belt on it's a lot of extra material if I wanted to wear this without the belt it'd be like somebody's grandma's nightgown from 1935 that's how I feel without the belt so I can't just without the belt I don't even think maybe if I got a small I could do without the belt but then I be wondering about the armhole under here because you know you get things too small and it start cutting you I don't I don't need that in my life so yeah I think I would just size down to a medium that way it's a bit smaller uh, and it'd still be cute with this sash so yeah that's the second one tie this tie up on here now the yellow one, I didn't mention this, but the yellow one, I got in the medium. When I originally, I bought it and then I tried it on because, you know, you can't try stuff on in the store right now. I brought it home and tried it on and I had the large at first. The large in the body part, like in this bell part, was too big. <sighs> like, it, it, was, it was still cute, but I was kind of lost. In the dress but I had a ton of space here not in a bad way in a good way I had a good amount of space here and putting it over my head I had a good amount of space to do that too um, a good amount of extra fabric to be able to stretch my arms through it and not feel like I'm about to rip it <laughs> a medium this part down here is great the bell part it's just the right amount of fabric just the right amount of bell I'm not lost in the dress it still has that flowy shape while you can still see my figure a bit I feel like but this is hard to get on this is hard to get on there's no stretch in this material it's a shirt style men's 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 shirt men's suit and shirt men's shirt whatever men's dress shirt type of fabric so there's no stretch whatsoever so when you're putting this on over your head a medium while it fits good everywhere else when I'm getting it over my head it does not I can get it you know but I need to put this on before I do my makeup because if I put this on after I might get makeup all on the collar part just on the this part down here the chest part I might get makeup all over it luckily today I went real slow I had the patience of a insert here I don't know but I had a lot of patience when I put this on so I didn't get no makeup on it but what if you running late you know what if you trying to get cute you going out to brunch with your girls and you took too much time doing your makeup because you wanted to dance to some music and now you got to hurry up and get dressed and you got to put this thing on real slow and your, girl, your girlfriend's outside talking about some, what are you doing? We told you about three hours ago we was going to be leaving at this time. You still getting dressed. Now you look you look like a fool. And it's all because the sizing is off on this dress. But yeah, I think, I think it's worth it. <laughs> it's worth it to just stick with the smaller size for me at least just because I mean it's got pockets but that's besides the point oh yeah did I tell you this got pockets girl this got pockets 
But yeah, I think I'm not gonna say all her dresses have pockets, but I mean, so far, all the dresses I tried from her has pockets. So get the Lisa Marie Fernandez collection because she got pockets on her dresses. Cause she ain't had no pockets. She ain't had no pockets. But um, yeah. I love this dress and I love this dress it's the same print by the way I don't know if you can tell on camera but this one is just the yellow background with white flowers and this is pink background with the same exact white flower pattern so yeah I really like the both of them so we're gonna go to the next collection we're gonna visit Kushni and I'm gonna tell you all about what I feel about her dresses all right stay tuned Okay, so this is the next one. Oof, right off the bat, <laughs> I need to mention before anything else get your right size. I didn't feel this in the other size that I bought. I, I originally started off, and we're going to go into size and two, but I originally started off with a size six. I did not feel the boning. I'm going to assume this is metal boning um, or plastic or whatever, but it's flexible. It might be plastic. The boning that's in the back of this dress to keep it, can you see me? Yeah, to keep it, uh, keep it shape on your back. The boning that's in it. On this side, it's stabbing me <laughs> in my back. It is, it's literally stabbing me. And I have this in a size 10, so maybe it's too big. So, but it, it, I mean, you tell me, is it too big? Now, this is supposed to be the, this gathering. It feels like it's too big when it comes to my butt. Like, it keeps getting this extra shelf of fabric on the top. But, um, yeah. I'm thinking maybe that's why it's too long, because I'm not a size 10 in real life. I'm like a size 6, size 8 depending on the brand so maybe that's why because it's a size 10 we'll never know but I like this they had this in a couple colors um, they had this in this one they had this in a navy blue color and as far as I know they also had it in like a highlighter lime green uh, like this but a little bit more yellow I don't have nothing like that in here to compare for y'all so my bad but yeah it's like that color green with a little bit more yellow too it's like a highlighter neon type of green yellow color slime like slime that slime like everybody on slime gang that color green with a little bit more yellow to it that is exactly what that color dress is and I want it but yeah, I like this in that color. But you know, it's a cute silhouette of a dress nonetheless. Uh, it has this slit detail here and it's high low. Oh, yeah, high in the front, low in the back. I thought that was interesting. I like that because I'm not really, yeah, I'm not really into the traditional high low type of thing. I don't know. I don't know what vibe it gives me, but it's just not a vibe I like. I'm tempted to say cheapy, but I don't know. I don't know. That doesn't make any sense. I just don't like it. But this version of High Love, I can deal with it. I like it. Now, where can you wear this dress? I don't know. You know, I I wear anything anywhere, girl. I feel cute. You know, when it's not too fancy, you can wear this anywhere. Now, I said you can wear this to the grocery store. People told me, no, that's crazy. But I think you could wear this to the grocery store, girl. I don't know. Some cute some cute slides. Um, I, I don't know what else you would pair with this. But I, I honestly wouldn't wear nothing on top of this. Just because, like, it has this cute detail right here. And who wants to cover that up? You got that. The back is supposed to be out. Like, this dress is... <laughs> this dress is cute, okay? She's cute. She is really cute. Let me turn from this side. Yeah, I think I could have went with an 8, but I don't see an 8. I'm going to have to check for the 8 in the green, though. But yeah, this is that one. 
The only thing is the six way too tight. Six is way too tight. Eight, I'm thinking, would still be tight because this feels just right. When I tell you this feels just right, it's the right amount of snug. When I sit down in it, let me see, are you still going to be able to see me? When I sit down in it, I don't feel like my stomach is being held hostage. Um, I don't feel like my chest is being held hostage. My back isn't like, I don't got a tremendous amount, a tremendous amount of back fat, but it's not spilling over at the top like, like I'm being ripped from everywhere, super heavy. Like, it feels comfortable when I'm standing up. And I mean, I didn't have too much to eat today, but my stomach's not on full blast. That's how six my stomach was. You would have thought that, I don't know, you would have thought I had a full six course meal that day. It was just doing too much. The eight, I'm scared that that's going to be the same thing. So I don't know. But the ten, I just feel like it's too much space. Like, it's just not too much but it's just slightly too much space maybe if I had a bigger booty you know if, if you're similar to me up here but you got a bigger butt maybe this is perfect for you maybe this is just not the dress for me for me even though I want it to be and you know what you know I mentioned that prices how much how much is these other ones the yellow one was 40 The pink one was 45 When I switch into the next one, well, you know what? You yeah, know, I ain't going to be able to get to it now. When I switch into the next one, I'll tell you how much this was and how much that is. Okay, so hold that thought. I'm going to be right back. Okay, y'all. So this is the last dress. This one is also by your girl, Kushni. Let's take a look. Let's take a look. Let's take a look. We got a satin panel right here. Let me tuck this in real quick. Okay, so how y'all like that pulled up? Or should I just let it hang? I like my back out, so I <laughs> I like it down. Maybe if I had a smaller size, I'd like it up. Nah, I like it down. But, uh, yeah. So, this is the next dress. We got this nice little slit here. I don't know how I feel about the slit placement. I feel like, this is me, I feel like I would have liked it on the side. But I guess I understand why it's right there. I guess it's there just because... Because this is where it meets, and it's just like, ooh, peek -a -boo, peek -a -boo. I might have liked it coming up the side, coming up more. I don't know. I don't know. I, I get why it's there, but I just feel like the placement's weird for me. I don't know. I feel like it's weird. But, so this is the top of the dress. Now, I love this. I love what's going on here. I think this is really cute. This is really cute. I like that. I really like that the straps, you see all of this right here? The straps is actually spaghetti until you get to a certain point. And then at that point, it's these thick pieces of fabric that are the same material as this first panel right here. I love this silk piece or satin piece on this dress. Satin dresses are in right now. I love I just the satin dresses are in. I really love the tie because it's a nice thick bow. I really love the two um, fabrics. I love how those go in contrast with each other. Because it's the same color. It's just the way that the fabric reflects light that makes it look slightly different. So I appreciate that. I really like that. The straps feel sturdy, even though they're on the thinner looking side, they're still thick all the way through. So I really like that. Everything's sewn together really nicely. Like, Tanya's collections always, they always construct it really well. So I appreciate that. 
and from what I know, these are actual real designers with their own lines independent of Target. They just do collaborations with Target. So it's not like random people just like, hey, let me do my first thing with y'all. Have hope in me. Nah, these are real people. So I appreciate they actually have skill. Now, one thing that I feel like is really odd with this, which could just be because this is probably, maybe it's too big for me, but this part right here i don't know if you can see that you probably can but it's like rippled like it's just too much like it needs to be tighter or something i don't know maybe i just like my clothes tight girl <laughs> but no it just it feels like it's too much fabric here but there there again the size is probably maybe it's just too big for me or the way it's constructed maybe it has extra fabric on the sides for somebody who has more hips and you'd be able to fill it out more if you have a slightly bigger hips than me. I don't know. We'll never know. But, um, yeah. Let's go ahead and turn around again. Let's look at it. Let's look at it from the side. Let's look at it from the front. Let me stand still for y'all. So let's look at it from the front. The other side with the material. I like these. I really like these dresses. Now, did I tell you about the price? This was fifty dollars. Lord. And the other pink one was also fifty dollars. Her dresses were up there in price. They were like starting off at fifty and then going to fifty-five, sixty, and maybe sixty-five. Her dresses were expensive. I really wanted to get all dresses from her line. But I was like, do you? Do you want to do that right now? It'd be a different story if, you know, the pandemic wasn't going on. Because you know, girl, that's still affecting everybody's paychecks. <sighs> still affecting paychecks. So I'm like, huh, I don't really have extra money to be just buying dresses and everything's closed. I live in PA. Things are still closed where I'm at. So, where am I going? Who taking me out? Ain't no place to go. So, it was a little... I, I can't justify it this time. Spending that kind of money supporting her like that. So, yeah, girl. Yeah. <laughs> but I did try a couple of the dresses from her. I returned them because it was just... The fit was just a mess. But for me, maybe not for you, but for me, I tried a blue one. Maybe I can find, I think I took a couple pictures of them hanging up though. I can insert them. I uh, tried on this blue leopard one. Really cute. Beautiful. I think I just need to try a um, larger size. And the one that I got, I think I tried the six. I think I need to go with the eight or a ten. Just because how it was constructed in the midsection, none of the fabric had, no, there was one dress that had stretch. But that one, this one, the blue leopard, did not have any stretch to it. So I think I need to go with an 8 or a 10, just so that the midsection is not so tight and the chest area can actually be drapey like it's supposed to be. So I think I need to go up in a bigger size than those. And then <clears throat> the next one was a uh, another blue piece like royal royal blue I don't know if you can see this but um they were like this color blue a little bit brighter but yeah that color blue like, maybe spot on with that but they were really pretty really pretty really pretty color blue the next one was like a I don't like the material I don't have nothing around me with that material because I don't buy nothing that material. But it was like a mm, like a scuba suit material, but not as rigid. It's like a poly, 100% stretchy polyester, like 80s exercise pants, but in a dress, but not reflective. It was like that type of material. I don't know if you know what I'm talking about, but that's as good as it's gonna get. But it was like that and I just I just didn't like it. It had the over the shoulder like type of 
winging going on. I don't know. I'm going to insert the picture so you can see what I'm talking about. But I just didn't, I didn't like it. I did not like it. And that one was another one that was like $50 or $55, one of those. But I didn't like that one. And then, what else did I try? Oh, and then it was this one in the green. The one, that one in the green, I got to find my size. Or I might stalk them and find out when these things go on clearance and then I'm a wreck up because I just, you know, I just can't I just can't justify spending that kind of money on these dresses and there's no place to go I just can't it's just it don't sit right with me it just it just don't sit right with me so yeah that was this whole girl I had fun with these clothes you know, when, when things do actually open up and I do have a place to go, I will wear these um, someplace. I'm still going to take pictures I'm outside of my front door. I'm still going to take pictures. But um, to actually go somewhere, I can't wait. But I'm here, girl. So that was this haul. Hopefully you found it informative or you just at least had fun, you know, watching me try on these clothes. Not that kind of fun. But, um, yeah, hopefully you had fun coming along the ride. Hopefully you go to Target and check out them dresses because there are there's some cute stuff. You know, if you got a different body type, if you extra curvy girl, you're going to have a lot of fun. You know, but for my girls that are average body type, you know, whatever, whatever this is, then... You know, be cautious. Be cautious, have fun. You can always return stuff. Don't be afraid to return stuff. Keep your receipt and don't be afraid to return stuff. If it don't fit, go right in there, return it, and go get the right size. Go try it on at home. If it don't fit again, go back in that store and return it. Don't have no issues. Don't feel funny about returning stuff. Don't let nobody make you feel weird about returning stuff. You go ahead and return the clothes. Because what you going to do with it if it don't fit? Okay? What are you going to do with it? Nothing. Nothing. So go ahead and return it. But yeah, girl. Thanks for checking back in. I'm going to see you back with another video. Peace out. <laughs>